What the hell happened? It's over. It just takes time. Yeah, how much time? Tamara and Miles have been in a pretty loveless relationship for the past year or so. And there have been a couple of straws that have landed on that camel's back, but the final one was when Miles testified on Christie's behalf. What the hell was I thinking? Well, in your mind, you thought you were helping a friend. And now I'm separated from my wife and my son. Miles and Tamara have gone down in flames. So the phoenix in Tamara's life is named Malik. I'm not trying to rush you or anything. I just want to be there for you, any way you need. It was one of those love affairs that kind of organically happened through Tamara and Malik's mother Gloria's connection in that psych war in season three. She was somebody who kind of looked after his mother. He didn't expect it. He came here to conquer and decimate, and he ended up finding some love. And you know, love changes everything for everybody. Life is short. It's messy. But it's perfect with you in it. She chose Malik and Malik chose her, and I think they're both gonna help heal each other. So that's really what I think they do for each other this season. Miles, I don't regret marrying you. I don't regret loving you. I will always love you, but I am, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm so genuinely happy. The way he feels about Malik's and Tamara's relationship is kind of, of any man who is dealing with his wife, he's a bit territorial. He knows that this is kind of a result of his own doing, but even still, he's very protective and can sometimes be a bit predatorial and aggressive. I know I'm the last person that should be giving you any advice, but maybe she needs a little space. You're right, Christy. You are the last person that should be giving me any advice. In his calamity of trying to pick up his life, he finds a shoulder to cry on and it kind of blossoms into something different. It's just not who you would expect. But then again, it's Miles, so you may expect it. After serving the papers and stepping out with Malik, I was bracing for some serious impact, but he has been so great. I know I have you to thank for that. Depending on which side you choose to be on, there's something for everybody. You've grown with us, you've loved on us, and you've got an opportunity to see what's next. Saints and Sinners, 